Hi, I'm Susan Powder, and I'm here to share something revolutionary with you. The truth. The truth about how to truly, once and for all, change your lower body. All fitness levels, all butt sizes. Oh, sure. You can have a small, saggy butt. You, there are butts that need a little conditioning, and there are butts that need, well, a little less packaging, like fat burned off. All kinds of people, all kinds of fitness levels, all kinds of butt sizes can use this video because of one thing, modification. What haven't we done to get rid of our butt and make our thighs thinner? Okay, let's see. We sweat as much as we can in one session only to put it all back on after we drink a glass of water. We've jiggled ourselves to death, we've rubbed it on, plugged it in, we've encased ourselves in hot steam, we've wrapped ourselves up in cellophane, and we've heard it all. Five days, thighs away, rub it on, take it off. Thinner thighs in 12 seconds. Well, I just have one question for you. Has it worked? Do you love your thighs? Please just punch with your lower body? I don't think so. I have been there and I have done that. Fitness is for everyone. Male? Well, sure, he doesn't need a good looking bottom. Of course he does. Fit, unfit, over fat. All of us need a good looking bottom. You can all work your butts off every day with me by modifying. That means working within your fitness level to build to the next and the next and the next. And here's the best news of all. Finally, you're gonna know exactly what it is you can do to truly change the way your lower body looks. Doggy lifts, lunging till you die. I mean, has it done any good? I can tell you what this video should be called. Spot Reduction Myth Smashing 101. You can and will change your lower body. You can burn the fat off that's on your thighs and you can make your legs well-defined and beautiful. Here's how you do it. You work the aerobic section of this tape at least three times a week. Aerobic, fat burning, it's gonna burn the fat off. Then you have a private lower body workout with us every day. Different parts of your lower body get a workout, including your abs and a fabulous stretch, meditation, pat yourself on the back, feel great kind of moment to yourself. It's effective, it's the truth about changing your lower body, and it's really easy to use. After your aerobic workout, just fast forward to the day of the week that you're on. Start with Monday, the next day is Tuesday, then fast forward to Wednesday and go through Friday. All you're gonna need to do this video, simple, simple, simple. A step, they're cheap and easy to get. You need a mat or a towel, you need some water, and common sense tells you that when you're thirsty, drink some water. You need a straight back chair and your bands, and here's how they work. Your bands are adjustable, they're easy to tie. Now make sure you tie them securely. And also remember to place the bands above or below the knee, depending on the exercise. And of course you need all of us. Oh, 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 one more thing. The wonderful information on form, resistance, control, all the things that are gonna really maximize the efficiency of the movement that you're doing to get the most out of your exercising. Well now all we gotta do is start. You ready to work out? Let's go. Hey you guys. You ready? Yeah. Everybody's ready. We're more yeah. than ready because we got everything we need here. We got a great group of people to work out with and you. You ready to burn your butt off? Okay, now that you know the truth about how to burn it off, you ready? You got to do it with us. You guys ready? Start marching this leg right here. Start marching. You want to make sure you use your arms. Hear the rhythm of the music, slow it down. It doesn't have to go fast. You want to use your body to burn the fat, which means big arms. Body nice and strong, perfect form, abdominal wall lifted, shoulders down, use the oxygen. Think about it. Last four, hear the move, and three, it's two, you're going to step side to side, singles, take the arms out of it, use the legs. Here's a movement that won't ever do you any good, this is never going to change your body, it's just kind of a nothing. Here's the same movement using resistance, form, extension. Extend out and squeeze in. Look at the form in this room. It is magnificent, to say the least. Nice and strong, extended, squeeze in. Everybody working at different levels of intensity. Everybody is at a different fitness level, so are you. If you want a bench this big, if you need a bench this big, it's up to you. You work within your level to build to the next and the next and the next. Okay, we're gonna change the move. Hear it, last four, three, use your oxygen. Two, now two steps to the side, go side, squeeze. If you wanna increase your level of intensity, all you gotta do is do what Sally and Lenan are doing, sit low. Sit, lift, sit, lift, activate these huge muscles. Sit and lift, squeezing. Look how high and low. 
That's it. Use the muscles to do the movement so you change your body. Here we go. Or just step side to side. But it all has to be done right. Squeeze and breathe right there. Last two both ways. Here. Singles. Hold it here. Hold singles. Step and squeeze. Four more. It's four. And three. Use your oxygen. It's two. Up, up, down, down. This leg. Take it up. Take it up. Go. Up. Ready? Think about what you're doing here also. You don't want to bang on the bench because it doesn't do any good. I mean, banging isn't going to burn fat. Stepping up and down using the muscles to step and squeeze up and down is what's going to burn the fat. Slow and strong. In oxygen. Build it up real slow. So avoid this, but do this. Lift, press, heel, toe. Think heel, toe. Correct form is the key. Ready? Up, down. Here's the move. Don't worry about when we change direction. If you don't get it, you can march in place and pick it up anytime. Here's the move. Last four. Three. It's two. On the floor, step down, side to side, side squeeze. If you didn't get it, you can just stop. March in place and pick it up anytime you're comfortable. Chest is up, lifted, shoulders down. Nice and strong and focused on what you're doing. Burning fat, increasing your fitness level, slowly and properly. Count it out now, last four. Four, hear the move. Three, it's two. Two steps to the side, go long and wide. Long, wide. Resisted, controlled, extended, all different fitness levels. With or without a bench, it's okay. You don't need to have a bench to do these moves, right? As a matter of fact, you do them better without, don't you think? Much prettier without, don't you think? Squeeze all the time prettier, I'd say so. Squeeze right here, guys. Now step wider, step wider, Hilda. Nice and wide. Out. Breathe it out. Use the oxygen always. Stay in oxygen. That means burning fat. Fat burns in oxygen, and you want to burn the fat. Increase the strength in the muscles underneath, and then you got a nice butt. That's the point. Step and squeeze. Listen to the move. Step. Hold singles right here. Hold, hold. Breathe it out. Step and squeeze. You guys ready? Four more now. Four and three. Close to your bench. Two. Up, up, down, down. Right here. Lead it. Up and down. You know what the point of this whole thing is? Is to burn the fat. That's what this movement is. Burning fat in oxygen aerobic. Burn fat. Burn fat. All right, look, everybody's just going like this. Burn fat, and then you increase the strength in the muscle underneath. Then what you have is a nice, tight, not big butt. That's the point. Not big butt. No big butts. Burn the fat, you guys. You can make your body as strong and as lean and as healthy as you want to be, but you want to do it properly. Lift. Hear the move. Four. Here it is. Three. Breathe it out. Two. On the floor, step only for four. We're ready to start. Step, squeeze, step, squeeze. Last four, four, three, two. Up, up, down, down. Left leg leads right there. Up, press. We're going to start our cardio section. All that means is we're going to increase the strength and endurance in our heart. Kind of important. Heart, lungs, kind of important with the whole living thing. Oxygen, it's life, it's energy, it's everything, and it burns fat. Ready? Last four, three. Remember, check your stepping on the bench. Two, slow and strong. Elbows are glued to the waist. Pick it up, press it down. Now, guys, pick it up. Make sure it's heel toe on that step. And most important, don't bang, because you want it to be effective. You don't need to bang, you need to lift. Lift your body and press it. Here's how you do these arms perfectly. Lee, pretend that there are two rubber bands on the floor. Squeeze it up, press it down. Squeeze, take the tension out of the hands, put the energy in the bicep muscle. That's what you're working, look at it. Squeeze, up, press down. Squeeze and press, no tension, it doesn't have to be this. It has to be resisted. Double time arms means double time arms. There's an option. Here's double, here's single. Do a little of both. Do like half and half. Kind of like a good creamer. Ooh, don't do that. Right here, lift, 
press or double. You pick it within your fitness level. Nice, Betty. Really nice. Body's lifted, hands relaxed. Totally comfortable in front of the camera, aren't totally. we? Totally. Very happy to be here, aren't we? Lift and press right there. Squeeze, press. All right, guys, here it is, right here. Four, breathe it out. Three, it's two. Take the arms out of the movement, keep the step. Building your level of intensity slowly, burning fat consistently like this. Keep it going. Now breathe. Last four and three. Hear the move. It's two. On the floor, step it. This side, right there. Out squeeze. Out squeeze. Breathe it out right here. Last four and three. Hear the move. It's two. Up, up, down, down. Here's the leg right there. Up, press. Now count this, we're gonna do a foot change. Ready? Don't worry about it, you'll get it, and if you don't, you can march in place and get it again. Don't worry about it. Count it out. Last four. Four, three, chest lifted. Two, opposite foot, switch, tap and switch, right there. Up, if you didn't get it, Terry, show us what we do if we don't get it. If you don't get it, march on the floor, relax at any point. You pick it up, do it again, Terry, it was brilliantly done. Just march. Relax, now pick it up now. Up, oh come on Terry, one more time, do it again. Look, it doesn't matter, if you gotta do it a hundred times, who cares? When you're ready, pick it up, now. Up, perfect Terry. Terry's a genius, because we love him, he's Mr. Man, he's a genius. Up, and down. Press, four more, four, hear the move. Three, it's two, elbows glued, bicep curls, last set, four, Slow, we're gonna change the arms. No panic, there's no rush. Two, now reach the arms forward back. If you didn't get it, take the arms out. Do it whenever you're ready, slow. This time, Phyllis, Yes. there is a rope right here. Reach the rope, pull it down. See, there's no tension. It's not here, it's chest, back, extend. Now, do the exact same move through mud. I know, it sounds a little nutty, but it's not. Reach, reach through mud, pull through mud. Reach through mud, even double time arms. Reach and pull through mud. Right there, add resistance. Chest, back. Otherwise, you could just do this and it's kind of totally useless. You know, you don't wanna, why bother? Sorry, Sally, just hit you. Why bother? Right? Hi. Why bother? I don't know. Doesn't make any damn sense. Come on. Tabitha, reaching and pulling. Extend, releasing, extend. Grab the rope, Tabitha. Grab it, pull it, elbows into your waist, right there. Cute move, don't you think? Four, listen to the move. You guys keep going, I'll catch you. Three, breathe it out. Take the arms out, keep it up. Shoulder, this is a great time to check your form. That means shoulders down, chest is open, abdominal wall is lifted, whether you feel it or not, just lift it up. Oxygen, ready, here we go. Last four, and three, breathe it out. It's two, opposite foot. Tap and switch right now, tap it. Up, press. Here we are, last four, four. Back to those arms, three on last two. Two, now arms reach forward and back. This is it, last four. Reach, slow, extend. Now, extend one inch more. Oh look, wrap your arms around me. It's a love thing. Four more, last four, hear it. And three, breathe it out, right here. Two, now the arms lift up to the side, right here. Lift them up, lift, press, lift. As if I'm, keep going, Phil, keep going. As if I'm sitting on your elbow, lift, squeeze. Use the arms right here. Use those muscles to do the lifting instead of just doing this. Lift it up, press it down. Ready? Last four, hear the move. It's three, breathe it out. Two, take your arms out, check your form, make sure you're in oxygen. Keep going, you guys, I wanna show you something. This is important now. Phyllis, if you were running, keep going. If you were running out of breath right now, yeah. and you needed to modify, wouldn't you get off the bench and march in place? Okay, just march in place. While everybody else is doing that, and get your oxygen back. That's all you gotta do. 
and you can work out with us the whole time. And then it'll get better and better and stronger and stronger and easier and easier, and that's called building a fitness level. Whenever you're ready, get back on whenever you're ready. Lift and press. Here we go. Last four. Three, you're a genius. Two. Now arms go up and down side. Here it is. Last four, we're gonna change the arms. Three. It's two. Hold your arms up, way up. Hold them up right here. Hold. Hold them, this is endurance. Now turn it. Turn them. Now you can do this, or you can do this. Hold your body up, lifted and strong. You're requiring the muscles in your body to hold a limb up. It's endurance, it takes a little strength and it takes a little time. The minute you get tired, Phyllis, drop them. Keep going, keep going, bring them up anytime. Doesn't matter what level you are, the minute you get tired, drop them, Sally. Drop them, keep moving. Shake it out, perfect, Sally. Pick them up again. If you get tired, Betty, what do you do? Drop them. Tabitha, what do you do? Drop them. Breathe it out, here we are. Last four, build the endurance slowly. Three, think about it. Two, take the arms out, keep the step, keep going. Up, up, down, down. Heel, toe, no banging. Lift, four more, breathe it out now. Four, oxygen. Three, burns fat, kind of important to life. Two, hear it, opposite foot, tap and switch. Now, up, down. Four more, last four. Three, it's two. Now hold your arms up, this is it for the endurance. Reach up, extend it. The more you extend without locking the elbows, locking the elbows doesn't build any strength, it doesn't do anything, except hurt you and doesn't do anything. Extend, extend your body nice and strong. Extend here, extend here, last four. Four, hear it, and three, breathe it out, breathe it out. It's two, now goal post arms, look at them. Bend like a goal post. Hold it here, relax the fingertips. Last four, here's the move. Three, I'll get the foot, you guys keep going. Two. Now look at this reach, reach high now. Reach center, pull down, the rope is there. Extend, pull, double time, Linan, big. Even though it's double time and it's fancy schmancy, and it is, and a very nice blue leotard, I might add, it's still, look at her form. It's still way up, way down, it's still full form. High, low, relax the shoulders. Chest is open, breathe, pull. Reach the rope, pull it, keep going. Hup, pull down. Up, four more, right here. It's for full extension. And three, pull it down. It's two, pull it down. Take the arms out, take the arms out. Take them out. It's up and down. If you didn't get it, it's okay. Get off the bench, march in place, and at any point, get back on. Count four now. It's four, breathe it out. Three, two, Opposite foot taps and leads for four. Up, down, up again, two more. Lift and press. Opposite foot taps and leads for one. Again, two, three. Now, opposite foot for two, count two. Lift up, again, opposite foot, press two. Go oh, guys, you okay? Again, opposite foot. There's a point to this, I promise you. I'm gonna get you into a move. Opposite foot switch, up, switch again, here we go, up, now singles, singles, that means this leg, now switch, this leg, everybody got it? Automatic turn on this, automatic, keep going, everybody's got it? It's because you're brilliantly coordinated, every one of you. Uh, nice, Hilda, off the bench, it doesn't matter if you have a bench or not, you're still moving in oxygen. You're still increasing your cardio endurance and burning fat. Ready to increase it a little bit? Lift, press. Now we're gonna add arms, reach them up. Reach, press down, lift. Pull the rope down, lift it. Real nice arms, Hilda. Give me an inch more on the arms. Up, pull, perfect, slow and controlled. Lift those arms. Now at the top, hold them up. Now pull them down, perfect, lift. Hold them up, good, lift them up. Lift higher, activate the abdominal wall, slow and strong, right there. Reach, press, really pretty, Hilda, keep going. Burn the fat, you guys, double time arms with Sally. Also, real high extension. Look how high her extension is. 
Lift from the obliques, lift from the abdominal wall, lift higher, Sally, give me an inch. Up, press. That's what increases the level of intensity. Number one, it's faster. And number two, the arms are really reaching. The body's really extended. There's a ton of levels in between. You pick the one that works for you. All right, everybody, anybody modifying? Perfect, Tabitha. You could take the arms out. There's another option. Lift, press, lift, reach high, you guys. Okay, maximize it just for a minute. Maximize it wherever you're at, maximize it. Ready? Hup, lift, pull. Here's an option. Last two both ways, keep moving. Now the option is add the knee, which is lift, up. Reach it high, lift, up, pull. You could do it with or without the arms. Lift, keep going, keep going. The leg is automatically gonna increase your level of intensity. It's a big limb. That leg, nicely. Lift, press. If anything in this move, lean a little forward. Try not to lean back and try not to shift your weight because you're not really doing much of anything. You're just kind of swinging. Hold your body up. That's it, you and Tabitha, keep it with just the knee. You could take the arms out, but the knee, the leg you're using is gonna increase your cardio. It's your option. Work within your level. Pull, lift, nice modification, Phyllis. Why'd you modify, keep going. Why'd you modify? You need to get in oxygen. Yeah, Look, ah, 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 I think that answers it. See, if you need to get in oxygen, bring your arms out of it. Another option is take the knee out, keep going. Perfect. Then you get your oxygen back, then you can go into any level you want. Work it, guys, so you can get healthier and stronger and leaner and feeling great. Slow, up. Okay, hear this move, last two both ways. Hear it, same move, take the arms out of it. Take the arms, keep going. Lifted, think through the nose, through the mouth with the breathing, deep breath in. Now last two both ways, hear this move. Hold singles on the side, step, lift, press. Lift, it's okay, Hilda, march in place and get the move. Perfect, keep going. You don't have to get the move right away, it's all right. You can pick it up whenever it's comfortable for you. But when you do it, do it right. Here's how you do this move right. It's a lift, it's a press, it's a level change right here. Lift standing leg, press standing leg, work it. Lift, press. Body lifted, perfect form. High low, you guys, high low. Lift, so pretty, it's so pretty. Lifted, okay, let's get the cardio going. Four more now, four, lift, press. Three, chest is high. Two, optional is that outside knee up. It's optional, slow, press, high low. This level change right here. The level change on the press down, the leg lift up, holding your body up requires a heck of a lot of strength. Shoulders down, chest open, it all requires muscular strength. That's what you're using. Use it. Go. Up, press. Optional, arms up. Lift, up, pull down. Lift, up, pull down. Nice. Sally and Lynn double time arms. Betty, no arms, it's all your option. Double arms with no bench. Hup. Press your arms through mud. Press them through mud. Legs through mud too, Terry. Legs through mud. Lift that knee through mud. Get the shin forward, nice. Lift, press, abdominal wall lifted whether you feel it or not. Go low, high, low. Four more only. It's four, three. Big, nice modification, you guys. No arms, no arms. Hold them back, shoulders down. Level change stays there. Last four, hear it. Three, listen to the move. Two, now step touch on the side here. Just step, I'll cue you, I'll cue you. Don't worry about the move. Last four and three, high, low, level change. It's two, same step to the front, same step, it's single. Up, press, ready, four more only. Four, breathe it out. Three, it's two. Up, up, down, down. This leg, just up, up, down, down. Add the arms, high cardio, press. Up, pull, lift, press. Now your whole body through mud. No lock joints, that means no lock knee. Nice soft knee, 
Nice soft elbows, but high, guys. This is it. Maximize this now. Reach up, Phyllis. Beautiful arms. Beautiful arms. Reach high, you guys. Hup. Ah. It's a specimen of fitness. This whole thing. Beautiful. Lift it up. Press it down. Hup. Press. Four more only. It's four. Oxygen. Three. Two. Take the arms out. Take the arms out. Right now. Last four. Here we are. Three. Listen to this move. It's two. Singles on this leg. Singles. If you didn't get it, don't worry. Just get it when you're comfortable. Singles. Keep stepping back. Slowly step to the right side of your bench. Slow. Step to the side, but keep stepping back. I'll cue you. Last four. Three. Get your oxygen. Two. Same step off the side of the bench. Same step. Press. High, low. Press. High, low. Nice. Now four more. It's four. Press low. Three. It's two. Over the bench. Over the bench. Go. Grapevine. Press. Don't just step over it like this. Don't lose all of this. Don't lose your abdominal wall lifted. Don't lose your shoulders. Don't lose your upper body. Hold it up. Require the muscles to do the movement. You'll get more out of the movement. Here's an option. Look at my arms. They press up, go low, up, elbows to ears, lift, because it requires all of this to lift. Reach high. Nice modification, Betty. Here's Betty's modification. Same move, beautifully done. Use your breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. Sally, give me the high. Look at the high. Plyo. Lift up, hup, same move, same move. Higher level of intensity, that's all it is. Hup, press that back leg back, think about hip flexor, press right there. It's beautiful, keep going, keep going. Look at the leg in the back. Look at Phyllis, perfect. You're pressing that leg back, push back, really pretty. Relax your hands, lift, press that leg back. High, low, press. Nice. Relax your hands. Up. Ready? Here it is. Up. Press low. High low. Last two both ways. Here the move. Up. Now the arms come out. Same move. Same move. Up press. Get your oxygen back. Through the nose, through the mouth. Last two both ways. Step. Now hold singles. Hold singles. High, low, high, low. Deep breath, guys. Good job, really good job. If you've done this in form and resistance and control and extension, and you've stayed within your fitness level, then you really have done something. Last four, breathe. Three, two, same step. Singles back, same step. Up, same step. Now up, up, down, down, take it, go. Up, time to cool down. What's so tough about this? This is perfect. Take a deep breath in, everybody. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Hup. Nice, Terry. Step into the middle of that bench. Make sure, check your form, always. Four more. Four. And three. Two. Opposite foot, switch. Tap and switch, right there. Up. Ready to cool down? Same thing as the warm up. It's gonna be an active cool down in correct form. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. You did a great job. Think about this. Last four and three. Deep breath in. Two. On the floor, step side now. Step side, squeeze. Don't compromise your form now. Remember, you can work within your fitness level. You can shorten your range of motion. Lee, step just not so wide apart. That's a shorter range of motion which will accommodate if you're tired, if you feel like you're fatigued and you wanna just lower it a bit, or you can maximize it. Go wide, Sally. Step, squeeze, step, squeeze. Nice and strong, in oxygen, four, breathe. Three, two, at a heel lift, which is simply this, curl, up, press, down, curl. Again, you can throw this move away just by doing this, which won't do you much good. Or you can squeeze. There's a beach ball right here. Squeeze your heel against the beach ball. You want to maximize it? Look at Sally, look at Lenan. Look at Betty. My gosh, Betty, what form you have. Keep going, squeeze it. Bring the heels to the butt, nice and strong. Lift, squeeze. 
Lift, squeeze. Go deep a couple of times, Betty. That's it. Very nice. Just a squat, lift, squat. Now regular. Go back to it. Last four. Hear it. And three. Squeeze it tight, Terry. It's two. Nice. Single step touch, you guys. Step squeeze. Nice and strong. Here it is. Last four. It's three. Hear it. And two. You guys keep stepping side to side. I'm going to show you. Right here. I'm going to press. Press. Whenever you're ready, go into a press. Lift and press. Exact same move. Heel on the bench. There's no noise here. Nobody's banging the bench. You don't want to do this. You want to press. Last two. Now hold the heel on the bench. Hold it on the bench. Hips are square. Shoulders down. Lean your body forward and just stretch out your legs. Make sure your head is in line with the spine. There's no lifted, hyperextended neck. How's it feel, Betty? Good? Real pretty. Chest is open. Think about your chest going forward, your abdominal wall lifted, and think about what you're doing, just falling into the stretch. Now's the time to cool down your muscles by holding. They're hot. You've just used them. Stretch them out now and think about flexibility and relaxation. Take a deep breath in and a deep, strong breath out. Lift your body up. Shake it out a little and switch feet. Very pretty, Phyllis. Lift up and over, kind of like a good bra. You know what I mean? Head is in line with the spine. Here's the side view. You stick your butt out. Hips are square and just relax. Shoulders press back. Head in line with the spine and press the chest forward. Take a deep breath in and a deep, strong breath out. Enjoy this. Just fall into the stretch. One more deep breath in, you guys. One more deep breath out. Lift your body up slowly. March it out. You guys get some water. We're going to come right back. You know what? You did it. You did a great job with a half an hour of cardio to burn the fat that's on your butt off. Now it's time to work your butt off. Every day, we're going to do five minutes of lower body, abdominal, and stretch, Monday through Friday. If you did it yesterday, then today is Tuesday. Same thing for Wednesday and on and on through Friday. Now it's time to work your butt off. Monday, outer thighs, yuck, it's Saddlebag City. But the cardio you just did is gonna take care of that. And now it's time to strengthen the muscles underneath the saddlebags that you're in the process of burning off. So lay it down to the side, outer thigh lifts. Let's do them correctly. Your head is laying down by your arm. I'm gonna prop my head up so we can talk for a second. Knees forward, ankles forward, toes forward. And here it is right here. It's lift up, in twos, press down, in two. Lift up, in two, Press down. Now, while Lynn Ann and Sally are doing this, I'm going to show you the modification, okay? The minute you get tired, the minute you get tired, here's what you do. You put it down and you rest your leg. You take a rest. Whenever you're ready, you pick it back up. It's very simple. You get back into position. You pick up. Two, you can modify any move. You don't have to do every repetition, but you have to do it properly to get the most out of it. Again, go. Lift, squeeze up. Press, use the outer thigh, gluteus medius, technical term, it's right here, lift, up, squeeze it, press down, again, go, lift, we're almost done, but do it properly, squeeze, again, lift, up, squeeze, last two, both ways, lift, up, now when you press it down, keep it down, keep it down, stretch it out by putting the leg forward. You could take the opposite arm and just press it back if it's comfortable and stretch through the muscle you just used. Take a deep breath in and a deep, strong breath out. Thinking about what you just did. Deep breath in, deep breath out, and let's do the other side. Ready? Lift up, support your back getting up. Let's take it to the other side. Same thing, check form first. Head down, knees, ankles, toes forward, and you lift it up whenever you're ready. If you've got a band, here's the lift right here. Press. You have the option of using the band or not using the band. Or you can try it a little bit here and there. Lift, squeeze that band, Sally. Press again. Lift, all the band is is added resistance. Keep going, lift up, check your form. Press, use the outer thigh to do the lifting of this limb. It'll strengthen it, again, it'll strengthen it. Squeeze. Think about the fat you just burned off in the cardio. Think about the strength you're increasing in the muscle underneath and think about how your butt's gonna look. Squeeze, again, again, go. Lift, shoulders relaxed. Press down, again, lift, up, press. Outer thigh doing the work, lift up. This is gonna strengthen the muscle underneath the fat that's burning off, that's the point. 
press. Let's do it right this time. Hold it down, hold it down. Press the leg forward, take the opposite arm back if you're comfortable, and just stretch out the leg you just used slowly, correctly. Take a deep breath in, deep, strong breath out. Now, let's take it to abs. Take your bands off if you're using a band. Lay flat on your back. Got the band off, Sally? Okay. Pull your heels into your butt. Make sure your abdominal wall is nice and controlled, shoulders relaxed. Here's the move. Hands on the thighs. Lift up, two, press. Look at my hands. They're lifting up to the top of the knees. Press. While Sally and Lynn do this, look at the modification. You don't have to go all the way up. You can lift to here and stop there and press it down anytime you want. So you could just go to here, just under the knee if that works for you. Or you can slowly lift just a little and then go down. It's up to you to work within your fitness level. But use the abdominal wall to lift the upper body. That's what you're doing. Here's the weight that you're lifting right here. Slowly. Again, go. Lift, squeeze with the abdominal wall. Press down. Lift, up, press. Again, take a deep breath in. While you're doing the movement, slow correctly. Lift, squeeze the abdominal wall. The minute you don't want to do this anymore, you can modify out of it. Two more. Up both ways. Take it up. Lift, up. Now take it down. Take it down all the way. Take a deep breath in and a deep, strong breath out. Support your lower back to sit up. Spend a minute with yourself. Take a deep breath in and a deep, strong breath out. Press your shoulders down. Take a breath in and a breath out. Close your eyes while you're breathing and just hear something. If you're waiting for the motivation before you get fit, it's never gonna happen. The motivation doesn't come from the outside and you won't always wake up feeling like exercising. No matter how you feel tomorrow, work out with us. Do your cardio, do your lower body, do your abdominal work, connect with yourself and take a couple of deep breaths. The motivation is in the doing because the results are fabulous. Take a deep breath in all the way up. Deep breath in, reach high, press it all the way out. Again, one deep, strong breath in. Breathe it in all the way up. Blow it out slow and strong. Thanks so much for working out with us. Good job. See you tomorrow. It's Tuesday, so it's got to be squat day, right? I mean, these are the biggest muscles in your body we're about to use. No, no, no. All that fat that's on top of your legs, you can't get away with the old saying, oh, I just have big gluteus maximus. It doesn't work that way. You know we're going to be burning the fat, but what we're going to be doing now is working the biggest muscles in the body. You ready for squats? Here's how you do it right. Stand up in front of your chair. Feet are shoulder width apart. You want to make sure that we're going to sit down in the chair and we're going to lift up using these muscles to do the work okay so stand up get ready to sit now it's sit in the chair lift up from the chair all the way down Sally sit in the chair lift up checking form here sit in the chair lift all the way squeeze your butt at the top lift slowly lift now why Sally and Lynn are doing it here's the form if you at any point need to modify this, the correct form is you can sit down and just hold it. You guys keep going, lift, you can hold it. When you're ready to do it again, you make sure you lift up, squeezing the butt right there. Sit down, lift, you can modify any time, but don't do the form incorrectly. You wanna get this to work, slow and control. If you need help getting down into the chair, which is okay, it just means you're unfit, so what? You can get a chair that has handles on the side, to support yourself down, you can hang on and press. Use these muscles, big muscles, quads, glutes, hamstrings, slow. Squeeze down, lift with your butt. Make sure your knees don't go past your toes. Here's what you want to avoid with this. Don't let the knees do this. You lift, squeeze, keep those knees right where they need to be. Now's the time to squeeze your butt right there. Squeeze, press, hold it down, hold it down. Time to stretch out. Really nice, simple stretch. Go to the edge of your chair, place your toe back, make sure your knee is in line with your hip, press your knee straight down to the ground. It's a wonderful quad stretch and hold. Shoulders nice and soft, chest is open. Take a deep breath in, front foot is flat on the floor. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Now, opposite leg, just lift it up. I'm gonna stretch it from here so you can see it. Right here, toe back, knee is straight down to the floor, shoulders down, chest is open. Front foot is flat, take a deep breath in, and a deep, strong breath out. Ready for abdominal work? Take it down to the mat. You're gonna take it here, 
Place your hands behind your head, elbows out. Right here, ready? We're gonna lift up in two. Lift up, press down. Lift up, again. You guys, you two keep doing it. I'm gonna show you something here. The key to abdominal work is making sure that the abdominal muscle is lifting the weight of your upper body. You know why you get neck aches? You get neck aches because you're trying to lift with your neck. Lift with your abdominal muscle. And if you can't, do one. You can do one. Here's your modification. You would lift up, squeeze, you would press down while Sally and Lenan continue. You take a deep breath in, deep breath out. Pick it up now. Lift up, press down. It's not how many you do. It's how correctly you do the movement. So use your abdominal muscle. Squeeze, it's a big one, squeeze. Press, take a deep breath in, always breathing. Squeeze, press, again. Lift, up, press two more, both ways. Lift up, this is it, squeeze. Now press down and hold it. Press down and hold it, press down and hold it. Take a deep, strong breath in, a deep, strong breath out. Support your back to come on up. Let's take a minute with ourselves. Shoulders pressed down, chest is open and lifted, abdominal wall is lifted. Thinking about the muscles you just worked. Close your eyes, take a couple of deep, strong breaths in. Let's just talk for a second. When I was 260 pounds and I was changing the way I looked and felt, the most magical moment was when it dawned on me that I could actually do it. When you know, now you know, you're getting correct instruction. There's modification, so anybody can do it. You can do this, knowing that it is just a matter of doing it daily. I could do it, and I did it, and it changed my body. You can too, and it will change your body. Fitness, being fit will change your life. Thanks for working out with us. See you tomorrow. Take a deep breath in. All the way up. Reach again. Oxygen. Take a deep breath out. It's Wednesday, so it's always butt day, but we're going to add some hamstrings. I have my band on just to add a little bit of extra resistance and to help you make sure you're doing it properly. But think about this when we're doing our workout today. During your lower body workout, the muscles that you're using burn a whole lot of calories. Lean muscle mass is metabolically the most active tissue in the body. Active means burning fat. Active means active. So let's burn fat and let's get active. Place your hands right on the chair. Don't lean on it, just hold them here. Here's the move. Place the, this outer leg just a little bit back, toe to the floor. Here's the move, ready? Lift your leg just a bit. Lift, up, squeeze, toe touch there. Lift, up, squeeze, toe touch there. Lift it, squeeze it, press. Feel the band, if you're using the band, you can feel that squeeze right there. Resistance using this muscle right here, using the hamstring together. Squeeze, up, press, again, hips are square. Squeeze, here's how you know if you're not doing it correctly. You're leaning forward, try not to lean forward. Hold your body up and lift, squeeze right there. You can feel it. Slowly, remember to breathe, breathe. It's the exact same movement without the band. Lift, up, press, last two, both ways, go, lift, up, now hold the leg down right here, opposite leg. Let's lift up the chairs and switch them to the other side. Hold it here, place the hands right there, same thing, outer leg. Lift, squeeze, press, you can feel it right there. Lift, squeeze it right there. Press, check your form, hips are square, lift up, chest is up. Lift up, squeeze, press, slow. Lift, up, Sally and, and Lynn are gonna keep going. If you're tired, here's the modification. Simple, stop. You can take your band off if you want to. Very simply, do the exact same thing. Lift, up, squeeze, touch down. It's the same move, with or without the band. Squeeze, press, you still have to resist. Lift, here's the modification. If you need to shake it out, just stop. Take a deep breath in and join us anytime you need to right there. Squeeze, now hold the leg down, hold it down. Now just shake it out. Let's take it to the floor. Lenann's gonna take her band off, take it to the floor. This position right here will stretch out the muscles you just used and if you can, if you're comfortable, reach your hands forward as far as you can on the floor. Make sure you don't hunch your shoulders up, press them down. Walk the fingertips out slowly, hold it there. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out and as you relax, go deeper into the stretch. You can walk them out a little bit. Take a deep breath in and a deep, strong breath out. Hold it for just a second, hold it. Nice job, just release it. 
The key to flexibility is to relax into that movement. Just relax and hold. Lift it up slowly. Let's lay on our back for abs. Ready? You want to keep your heels a little bit apart this time, just a bit. Place the inside arm across your chest. And what you want to do is with the outside arm, reach, but you're going to reach beyond the knee. Lift, up, press, down. Lift, you're working the oblique muscles. Sally and Lenan, keep going. You're working the muscle that actually wraps around the side. And you know what it does? If you burn the fat on the outside of your body, which you're doing, and you increase this muscle, the oblique muscle, talk about a waist. Talk about a beautiful cut. Lift, up, press. This is how you get that waist. Reach, up. Press, breathe it out. Lift, up, press. Think about it, one more, both ways. Reach, now drop it slow, shoulders go down. Take a deep breath in, switch your arms. Very simply, here it is, lift up, reach across, press down. You lift, reach across. Remember the abdominal wall is lifting the weight of your upper body. That's what's using this muscle, right there, squeeze. Keep going, you guys. Up. I'm going to modify it by stopping for a second. Lift. Keep going. And then I can join you anytime. Now, reach up. Lift up. Reach. Press last two both ways. Lift up. Reach. Now, take it down. Hold it down. Take it down. Take a deep breath in. And a deep, strong breath out. Support the lower back and sit up. Press your shoulders down, lift your body up, take deep breaths in and deep breaths out and just spend a moment. You can close your eyes or keep them open, but think about this. The muscles that you're using, you're increasing strength in, you're literally bringing them back to life almost. You're getting more oxygen to get through there. You're increasing the strength of this active tissue, lean muscle mass. It helps you live your life. That's the point of it. Not just to have good looking legs, although you will. It is to increase the life in the muscles, increase the oxygen, increase the things that are gonna make your life easier. Yes, you can burn fat. Yes, you can increase strength. But it's so much more important to you in your daily life, what you're doing now. Take a deep, strong breath in. Lift your arms up. Take a deep breath in. All the way up. Extend. Feel your body. Now blow it out. One more time. A deep, strong breath in. All the way up. All the way up. Extend, extend, extend. Blow it out. Thanks for working out. See you tomorrow. Thursday, plie day. Now that doesn't mean you have to go grab the old ballet bar from the garage, because you don't have to be a dancer to do this, but we're really gonna work the butt off with these, plies. Make sure your feet are far enough apart so you can go deep into the move. Energy is in the heels, your body's lifted nice and strong. Here's the move right here. You're gonna sit, down, and lift up. Now, sit, down, lift, up. Sit down into the plie and lift up and squeeze in the butt right there, sit, down, lift, up. You don't want to lean on your chair. Make sure that you're not leaning. Just balance right here. Sit, down, lift. Sally and Lynn are going to keep doing it. Make sure in your modification within your fitness level you don't lean forward. It's really important. Hold your body up. The minute you get tired, here's what you could do. Do the final one. Lift it up. Shake it out. Get your breath. Relax your shoulders. Get your form and go back in at any point. Get your form ready and go right back into the movement. Sit, down, lift up. Last two both ways, press down, then we're gonna go into single presses. Single presses now, go down, lift up. Down, lift up. Make it a real fluid movement. Down and up, always through mud. Think of the resistance. You're pressing down through mud, lifting up through mud. Use the resistance, use the form, slow. Don't lean on your chair. Keep your balance, try not to get forward. Stay straight on. Use your legs to do the work, squeeze it up, press and lift. If you're tired now, all you gotta do is modify. Take it out, take it out, relax. Get your breath, think form, think about connecting with what you're doing and go right back in at any point. Do two of them correctly, it's okay. You don't have to do a whole bunch right now. Press down, but stay with it when you're doing it. Press, again, press down, lift up, lift it up. Shake them out, take a deep breath in and a deep strong breath out and take it to the floor. Sit straight up, shoulders press down. Keep your legs apart just a little bit and if it's comfortable just kind of lean forward. You can grab underneath your legs and pull yourself forward to stretch out the muscle. Shoulder down, avoid this, avoid this kind of stuff. 
Lift up, nice and strong. Take a deep breath in and a deep, strong breath out. Again, think about the chest moving forward, leaning forward and hold. Just stretch it out. Deep breath in and deep, strong breath out again. Okay, lay down for abdominal work. First thing you gotta do is pick your legs up if it's comfortable. Make sure your ankles are crossed. Here's the lift with the arms out. You lift up on one right now. Lift up, press down. Again, lift using the abdominal wall to do the lifting of the upper body. Lift up, press. Remember, be really aware. Don't lift with the neck. Relax. You gotta lift. Chest goes up, squeeze, Press, if you need a modification for this move, very simple. Take your legs down, look at the move, same thing. Lift, up, press, down. Lift, up, squeezing at the top. Think about the abdominal wall internally, squeezing, and press again. Lift, if you're tired at this point, you could take yourself completely out of the move by just releasing it. Take a deep breath in, pick it up anytime. Lift. Up, but do it again. Lift into it right here. Last two both ways. Squeeze, press, hold it down, down slowly, slowly. Bring the legs down, bring the legs down. Take a deep breath in and a deep, strong breath out. Support your lower back. Lift yourself up. Sit up. Lift your body up, shoulders down, chest is open, head and neck relax. Take a deep breath in and a deep, strong breath out. This is the part of the body that a lot of us are really disconnected with. You never think you can get it back. You can't get the strength back. There's too much fat on top of your stomach. Yes, you can. You can burn the fat that's on your stomach off, and you can increase the strength in the abdominal wall underneath, and you can get back the strength right here, and it's strength that's so very important to your daily life. Take a deep breath in, and a deep, strong breath out. One more time. Take a deep breath in, this time with the arms all the way up. Reach all the way up and blow it out. Shh. Deep breath in, all the way up, reach up. Extend up, 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 lift through your body. Now press it out, hold it down, release the shoulders, take a deep breath in, and a deep breath out. Thanks for working out with us, see you tomorrow. Friday, hamstring day, because you can't move forward without them. And that's what you're doing in your life, moving forward, getting healthier. So let's get some healthier hamstrings. Stand with your feet just slightly apart, fingers just balancing on the chair. The movement is, heel is going to go to your butt and you're going to squeeze. Ready? On one, right here. Lift it. Lift, squeeze, press, down. Try and lift the heel to the butt. Lift it to the butt. Press, all the way down. Hips are square. Bodies forward, abdominal wall is lifted always, shoulders down. Deep breath in, deep breath out, and squeeze right there. Hamstrings press down. Lift up, press down. If you need a break, you know what to do. You can take one. Just stop right here. You guys keep going. Shake it out. Take a deep breath in and a deep, strong breath out, and go right back in. Squeeze, press down. Lift up, try to avoid leaning forward. Think about what you're doing, increasing the strength right here in the back of your legs. Slow, lift, up, press. Last two, both ways, here it is. Lift, up, press, release it, release it, right here, release it. We got another leg, thank goodness we got two legs, huh? Ready, hold it here, let's do the other leg. On one now, lift up, squeeze, press, down. Always check your form. Body lifted. Abdominal wall is high and strong right here. Lift. Always breathing. Slowly. Lift. Squeeze. Press. Check the shoulders. They're down and relax. Chest is open. Oxygen. Right there. Lift up. Squeeze. Press. Again. Lift. Up. Press. Keep breathing. Lift up. If you need a break, simple. Stop. You can just stop. Shake it out, refocus, and go back in. Lift, but when you're doing it, do it in resistance. Form, control, extension, up, press. Think about a beach ball. A beach ball right here between your butt and your heel. Squeeze the beach ball with your heel. Last two both ways. Here's the movement. Hold it down, hold it down, relax it. Let's go around to the chair here. You want to stretch out the hamstrings. Really simple, nice stretch. Just press the outside leg right here, soft knee. Toe is up, heels down, and you just lean over. Again, head is in line with the spine, not back. 
straight. Your head is in line with the spine, your body's lifted, and it's up and over. Place your hands on your legs. Try not to lean on it. Just place them here and hold. Take a deep breath in, a deep breath out, lift it up, and switch legs. Same thing, heel down, toe up, hands on the thighs, and you just lean forward. Chest is up and over, head is in line with the spine, and you're stretching. You can really feel it, it feels great. Take a deep breath in, and a deep breath out, lift your body up. Ab work, last day of ab work, simple. This whole thing is very simple, isn't it? Take it down to the ground. Here we are. Place your fingertips on your head here, so your elbows are forward like this. You just place your fingertips. Here's the move. We're going to lift the outside leg up and hold it there. Abdominal wall is pressed down, and here's the lift right here. It's lift, squeeze, press down. Lift, squeeze. You can feel it. You can feel it here. Lift, squeeze the abdominal wall, press it down. Again, lift, squeeze. You know what to do if you're feeling pressure in the neck. Take it out of the neck. Make the abdominal wall. Lift the upper body. Lift. That is the weight you're lifting. Again, lift up. Press last two both ways on this leg. Lift up. Now press it down. Hold it down. Switch legs. Inside leg right here. Hold your hands and lift. Up. Squeeze. Press. Again. Feel the contraction right there. Squeeze. Press. Oxygen. You gotta breathe right here. Squeeze, press, again. Lift, up, press, again. Feel the contraction right there. Squeeze, press, oxygen. You gotta breathe right here. Squeeze, press, again. Lift, up, press. Last two, both ways. Lift, press, up, all the way down. Legs are down, take a deep breath in. And a deep, strong breath out. Support your lower back again, make sure, and lift your body up nice and strong. Wow, well done. Take a deep breath in and a deep, strong breath out. Relax your shoulders, head is lifted, chest is open, breathe. Now with the arms, take a deep breath in. All the way up and a deep, strong breath out. One more time, think about what you just did. Work the muscles up, 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 up. Burn the fat, blow it out now, the oxygen, blow it out. Just take a moment. You know what this video is? It's an industry safe, enjoyable, real people getting real end results. It's all the stuff that you need to really burn the fat off of your butt and increase the strength and the beauty that's underneath. All you have to do is do it with us every day. You know, you might not feel like doing it. There may be plenty of days when you think, I don't want to exercise, but just put the tape in. I guarantee no matter how you felt before you did, after you work out with us, you're going to feel fabulous. Be well.